guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel and in today's video um today i decided that i wanted to go on a little hike with the dogs so i wanted to take you guys along with me and show you the hiking trail that we're going on um because uh they have like little land sites i guess or historical sites is that what you call it um but yeah anyway we're going um, to uh, a place called Mad Rock. Um, so yeah, let's just jump right into this video. All right guys, so we're on the trail right now. Um, sorry if it's a bit windy because it's a bit windy out. Well, there's a breeze. And there's Kyle. So this is kind of like where the trail is. Like the trail goes all the way around, all the way over there. Also, it's by some water as well. So, where we're to is actually called Mad Rock. Um, this is um, just pretty much to the edge of the, uh, I don't know where you would actually say, um, but yeah, it's at the edge of Newfoundland, um, uh, like the edge of the island. got the dogs I'm not gonna go do that so yeah and there's Lily there's also um little signs because there's like little uh little tiny shacks and stuff like that up here and there's also a grave site up here um it's all like historical stuff and like little things about uh Newfoundland and stuff like that so again and show you guys also guys this is the view down there is where the cars are and there's Kyle so anyway guys um we're a little bit deeper in you can kind of see what I mean by we're on like kind of like a cliff kind of thing so yeah there's all kinds of signs saying um be careful caution of edge because some people have fallen off. So, I'm sure you guys down here know the lake. Try to show you without the dogs going over there. And yeah, show you guys the view. And Kyle. <laughs> also, guys, Kyle's afraid of heights. So, you can imagine um, how scared he is on this hill. So this is uh, one of the signs, well there's a couple back there, but um, as you can see, keep off the edge, and then those, and yeah. There's also a lot of people walking today, and um, I also, it, I'm also very nervous to uh, vlog in front of people, so that's, uh, that's that. And as you can see, guys, it's absolutely beautiful. It is. And Booby is at breath. <laughs> and there's Lily. Lily's at breath too, but Booby goes over the top. <laughs> and yeah, just look, guys, it's beautiful. <laughs> Alright guys, so as you can see by the uh, little fence over there, we're coming up on the um, kind of like historical sites, and yeah, that's where we're going to right now. So as soon as we get up to the first one, I will show you guys. Alright guys, so there's a sign that says, uh, let me zoom in for you says that and that's the island over there I'm pretty sure and then we're coming up on the little shack here 
Also guys, if you ever go on this walk, um, it's very boggy and muddy and gross. <laughs> so wear shoes. Um, there's also wasps nests on top of it or growing out of the side of there. And there's also people over there. <laughs> so we're gonna move over just a little bit so the wasps don't see us. The wasps. So then there's this little tiny shack. Hang on, Lily. And then there's a little sign explaining what this little thing is and about the little jigger, j juggler's cove. And yeah, come on, Lily. Okay, so also when you walk up this way, just up over the hill. See that little uh, little gate or fence, really? Not a gate. It's a fence. All right, so we're coming up to it now. Also, guys, I'm out of breath because this is a far hike. So there's a little picnic table for you to stop, and if you want to have a little lunch, um, so this little area is a historical gravesite on Juggler's Cove. So yeah, this used to be a gravesite. Um, there's actually a grave over there. I'm not gonna go over there or anything, but the person who is buried, his name is William Earl and um, he died in 1776 at the age of 67. So yeah. So now we're gonna sit down and uh, give the dogs some water and maybe a little snacky poo. And when we start walking again, I will pick up the camera and show you some other historical sites because there is one up over there. And this video please leave a like and also don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notifications so you do not miss any time i upload and yeah i'm hoping to do uh more videos like this like little hikes and little um little videos to show you guys um about where i live and stuff like that like stuff in newfoundland that you can go do if you guys ever visit go get water lily and yeah and also guys i'm very sorry if the audio quality isn't as good um we are on a cliff and on a hill so it is a bit windy because of the water that's over there as well so i'm very sorry about the audio quality i hope you guys enjoy it anyway let me show you the dogs um booby is not eating his treat but lily has dug into her treat hey lily this is kyle's snack some of the chips and ruffles dip what a good snack to go hiking vinegar chips then so yeah um this is the little view that we have um also just then i told you guys that there is a little site right there that we can go up on i'm not sure if i'm gonna go up there because you can also go hiking all the way up there as well um yeah it is pretty <laughs> cooper boy where is he gone over there there he is. Hey, make this way, buddy. So, yeah. Alright, guys. So now we're done with our little snacky knacky. And now we're coming up to the little site that I wanted to show you as well. Um, it's actually not really a site, it's actually an outhouse. So, here is French's Cove and Juggler's Cove. And then when you come over here, there's a little outhouse for 
people on little hikes and walks. So, no, I wouldn't go in there either. There's probably bugs and wasps and everything in there. And as you can see, it says toilets, and the trail continues that way. But we're doing it kind of, kind of backwards. So, because you can start at the beginning of the trail. We started at the end because that's where you park and stuff and that's where that little tiny beach is and yeah there's also all kinds of these flowers these flowers are always are always infested with bumblebees and i hate bumblebees lily don't touch that bumblebee lily loves bumblebees she likes to eat them She loves to eat bumblebees. Loves to eat bumblebees. And there's Kyle and Cooper. And yeah. Did you take the backpack? Okay. So yeah. Even if I didn't, I would be going back to get it. No. So it's not as windy right here. That's because we're kind of surrounded by hills and cliffs. I almost just broke me. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, hold on to the camera. So we walked all throughout here and all over there and also over there. I don't even see where the car is. <laughs> no, the car is behind that little um, cliff there. It was just see it just seemed on because like the trails are swerving swerving everywhere. Yeah, it is a long walk though. Yeah, but like when you look that way it's actually not that long. Yeah. Blueberry. But I mean, yeah, there's all kinds of blueberries. Right there. Right there. Like blue bear moon. <laughs> blue bear moon. So yeah. It actually is a very long walk. But uh, it's not as long as you as you think because like you're just, like stopping and looking and you know seeing how beautiful the trail is and how the water is and stuff like that and yeah it's basically that. I'm waiting for any minute because really just out of the way and not Yeah. <laughs> we have a very lazy beagle, as you can tell. He's already out of breath. Well, actually, the only reason why he's out of breath is because he um, wants to just take off. He just wants to go. And so he's always hauling on himself on the leash and on his little harness. So that's that. Okay, guys, so we're coming at the end of the path. And I'm also whispering because I don't know if anybody is at this cafe or not. But, at the end, it brings you to the cafe. giving the animals something to drink and yeah so now I say we're going to go and get something to eat. Are you hungry? Mm -hmm. a little bit hungry? So could you go and get something to eat? Like a little snack snack snack? Yeah. Yeah. Might as well get supper as well but we don't have to stay in. That's fine. So anyway guys now we're going to go so yeah, um, also guys, we saw on our walk um, a teacher that we used to have in high school. So um, yeah, there's that. All right guys, so we just got home and we got some Subway, 
And also, guys, I want to show you um, something that uh, we bought today. And also, Kyle brought home this little plaque thing. And it says, the more, the more I learn about people, the more I love my dogs. So, we need to find a place to put that because it's very relatable. And we went to the store. And, um, and now I got to show you. I got a new little uh, toy box for the dogs. It's a little, like, cuter little basket than what we got. Um, it says, life is better with a dog. And that is very true. I also got a container for my purses. So anyway guys, uh, this is the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a big fat like. Comment down below what you would like to see next. And also guys, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Turn on your post notifications so you do not miss any time I upload. And without further ado guys, this is the end of the video. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.